evening i have given the topic like this okay power tally ba td okay so huh. it's about using and combining all this uh, uh, okay great great thanks over to you so uh, over to you sir for present so thank you for giving me this wonderful opportunity friends i am so happy and proud to be with you on this uh, third season and uh, i am so happy to be here with you so let me try to share my screen first so please confirm whether you can see my screen i hope you are seeing my screen yeah uh, just a second sir it's just still on a sharing mode yeah now it's visible okay so as you can uh, uh, no no it's 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 dis disappeared again let me try to share it again uh hope you can see my screen now at least yes yes i am able to so as you can see i have given the topic as power tally bi tdl that means a combination of tally and creating a tdl and uh, using power bi okay so it is about tdl automation and uh, automation and reporting so let me try to tell about the problem statement let me quickly go through the uh, maybe the slides uh, then we will enter into the project okay? so the problem statement is like this tally data extraction is manual and complex in other words we have to export the entire data into excel or xml or somehow it is entire uh, audit perspective or entire audit analysis cannot be done inside tally itself so that is why we try to pull out the data from uh, tally and lack of unified odbc tables for transactions are not available master data there is a odbc tables are available in tally itself and then inefficient xml and excel report that means uh, we have to download multiple reports and data cleaning and structuring is still required again we will be using power query or something like that python also we are using so it is time consuming for uh, uh, cas and it really requires some kind of manual intervention okay that is what i thought why oh, should be uh, not automated okay so for that my proof of concept is like this let us create a private gpt model ourselves because even though i was knowing about c language even though i was knowing about multiple uh, coding languages but when i was going through tdl which is tally definition language is a entirely a new kind of language uh, developed by tally themselves learning that uh, can you see my screen i hope you are seeing my screen right yes sir yes sir yes, okay okay so uh and uh, learning that new language is very very difficult and once this uh, a has come the first thing i was thinking is okay i think i can also code using tdl okay without even knowing what is tdl let us try to create some tdls okay and for that i was using chat gpt which was uh, not great so because it was not knowing about tdl there is no uh, much of content available uh, with regard to tdl that's why maybe the reason okay that's why i was thinking about creating our own uh, gpt and then uh, tdl automation creating some tdl scripts and then streamlined workflow that is my proof of concept so then which are the tools i have used the tools i have used is power platform which is power query and power bi for data transformation and visualization first private gpt to create the tdl and then uh, uh, trained with so many things let me try to show it to you and some of the ai assistants i was using is chat gpt cloud ai for dax generation in power bi okay so then i am going to tell about the entire integration workflow which is i am creating a private gpt generating that uh, uh, a tdl using private gpt then i am giving that uh, tdl to the tally erp data then through odbc connection i am getting the data into power query using ai tools like chat gpt and cloud here also i have used gpt so uh, we were creating i am creating about dax and then entire power bi dashboard we are creating okay? so then uh, what is the solution the solution is the my tdl can extract entire data in a single odbc table from the entire tally okay and the entire data pipeline is only through odbc and power query into power bi totally automating and uh, ai tools generate dax formulas and enhancing financial insights and then last one results and benefits so what is the eff efficiency boost we are having okay now we are automating the tds task and uh, what kind of insights i am going to show you you will be seeing just in two days i was generating some 11 reports and the scalable solution here i want to talk about it because once you have done for one client for one tally then for every client it is okay okay that's the point okay one time we are doing and one time designing many times you are using so why we have to stop now let us try to go live and let me show my entire project okay so first of all i want to go to my gpt 
Hope you are seeing my GPT. This is Tally GPT live and only for me. And I have configured only by what? This GPT will be used for creating Tally definition language coding, which is created by me, which is given with so much of uh, uh, knowledge base. The input is entire TDL reference manual given by Tally, which is about 600 plus pages. And some of the TCP files I have, uh, I have got from the internet and also in the AA class. And this is also again very important. So this is the Tally developer uh, uh, programming language. And inside the samples, there are n number of text files. Okay? These are all text files available, which are samples. And what I have done is again asked the chat GPT to create, to create a program to combine all the files into a single file. Okay? So this is what I have done with a, a combined text file, which is again using AI only. This is about 35,000 lines of codes combined into a single file. And I was uploading to Tally GPT so that it can learn TDL. Okay? So like that, we have added so much of uh, input knowledge base to that TDL, then uh, to that GPT. Then I was asking that chat GPT about this. Can you create, okay? By going through the knowledge base I have uploaded before, can you create a simple TDL which can get the relevant details of all the voucher collection as a table, like data, whatever the columns you want, okay? And it took about three days, friends. It took about three days uh, going for, uh, forth and back. Okay, we were asking questions. So only A may not be helping, but when we are giving the proper input and along with human being, the A can do great things. Okay, that's the thing. So mm -hmm. I have created one uh, TDL. So this is the TDL. Uh, let me try to show it to you. Okay, I don't want to show the entire uh, TDL because it goes into a number of uh, pages. So let me try to at least show you first page. Okay. So if I go to this ODBC, this is about the power tally BI TDL that I have created without even knowing what is TDL. Okay. So that is the beauty. And uh, this is about the entire code. Okay. It, it goes into maybe so many lines. So now I am going to demonstrate it. Please see here. Okay. I go to tally. As of now, there is no button here. Okay. So let me try to first of all install this TDL. So go to help. And then TDLs and add-ons, manage the local TDLs. So let me say yes. And uh, I'm going to open the same, uh, I'm going to copy this path and let me put it here. So specify the path and if I press enter, now it gives me this Power BI Tally TDL. If I press enter, it is getting loaded. So once it is getting loaded and if I press escape, you can see Power BI Tally BI TDL, which is available here. If I double click this button, friends, now we are getting the entire tally data in a single table, okay? Both journal or everything, journal, payment, receipt, so entire data, okay? It is like a total dump from the tally. So once we have got this, I can export it here itself, or we can do what? Or we can get it from the ODBC itself. So this can be easily pivoted using Excel for other uh, uh, reports, sir. But let me try to show you in Power BI how I have done it. Okay? So this is in Power BI. So most of the uh, DAX code is being created by, again, uh, ChatGPT. So if I go to this dat, uh, date table formula, think about it. Can we create in a single day something like that? Okay. So this kind of code, which we don't even know, we have asked ChatGPT to create it. Attention, sir. Two minutes left. Uh, sorry, sir. Okay. So I go to the first page. So these are the 11 reports that is being created using Power BI. So let me try to show you. I can see any day trial balance. Okay? Any day trial balance from the tally. I can just refresh so that I am getting the new data from the any tally user. Okay, Any tally uh, connection. And this is about seeing any ledger account. I can go through any ledger account like this. And the entire uh, journal entry is being given as a contra. And we can see the easily the income and expenses. What is the net profit percentage and all. Okay. I can go into the details if I want. Okay, we can go into that. And that's the power of Power BI also. So what about the income and expenditure trend? Okay, this is about the trend we can see and whether the expenses are moving in a bright way. Here we are seeing income is reduced, but expenses is moving up. Okay, these things we can do. And uh, accounts without any transactions. Okay, so opening balance is there, closing balance is there, but there are no transactions. Okay, that kind of entries I have taken. Squared up accounts, that means what? Accounts which are having opening balance, but there is no closing balance. Okay, that means uh, this year it was squared up, and accounts having only transaction. That means there is no opening balance, there is no closing balance, but there are only transactions. And debt accounts, 
this money accounts are opened without even having any transactions okay like that all these kind of audit points of view here we are seeing some trend so many aspects we can do it friends so my tdl is the starting point and uh, 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 thank you for giving me this wonderful opportunity this project is just now started i think uh, it can go through even hundreds of reports maybe in one month okay so thank you for giving this opportunity and uh, thank you friends see you guys yeah uh, yes uh, thank you sir nice uh, topic to go ahead with power daily bi tdl and uh, nicely explained mm, so we move on to our